Now, Nigerian singer Ira Star's essay concert cancelled over verses. All right. Nigerian singer Ira Star's essay con concert cancelled over verses. Ira Star or Ira Star's show in South Africa has unfortunately been cancelled. This comes after the Nigerian superstar and her team were denied visas just days ahead of the event. In Zanzi's is furious at the news, with some netizens refusing to believe the visa story. Welcome people, welcome my lovely viewers to another exclusive right here or today's exclusive right here on TJ Studios. I am your Commander-in-Chief and as usual, as you they see me here, it means there's something day in the pipeline. Be it in the African music space, wherever I am here, you can also refer to me as a Mecca. Alright, somebody has added Friday to my name, so you can refer to me as a Mecca Friday. Okay, so let's do this. What is on the bill today? I'm actually shocked as to an article I saw out there about ira star and it bust my mind a bit i don't know what is wrong or what is happening or uh, in south africa let me put it in that regard i think something of a mishap might be happening in south africa which i don't actually know all right now nigerian singer ira star's essay concert cancelled over verses all right nigerian singer Ira Star's essay con concert cancelled over visas. All right. One thing I know is that it's not just to the extent that they were just cancelled. Himself or herself, sorry, and her team were cancelled on numerous occasions. And I don't actually know why. So I have an article to that read and then I will expound on it. And then you basically share your thoughts with me in the comment section as to what you think is wrong. It's the commissioner, all right, commissioner of, you know, South Africa in Nigeria, thinking to the extent that because of the football thing or football, whatever, which brought about threats from certain South Africans, if they issue visa or visas to Irasta and his team, there might be a pandemic or, you know, a, a, an unforeseen circumstance, circumstance happening during the Nzanzi event. That is how they call it, all right. Okay, or is it because Nigeria gave it to South Africa with to, with to in the penalties, so they feel that they are a bit better and then they are doing what they are not supposed to do? Well, that is why I'm here. Let's go for this quick commercial break, come back and expound on it on today's editorial. <laughs> Okay, guys, welcome back. So, like I said, let's read this daily. Let's read this article to that effect. Ira Star or Ira Star's show in South Africa has unfortunately been cancelled. This comes after the Nigerian superstar and her team were denied visas just days ahead of the event. In Zanzi's is furious at the news, with some netizens refusing to believe the visa story. Nigerian superstar Ira Star will suddenly not make it to South Africa anymore for her in the city concert. According to the organizers, the rush hit maker and her team were denied visas, and her South African fans are not taking the news well. It's been a downhill since Bafana's or Bafana Bafana lost to Nigeria, all right, in the Afghan semi finals. Now, music lovers won't get to see their favorite Niger star perform in in zanzi okay it's sad that ira stars in the city concert sched scheduled for johannesburg and cape town on 16th and 17th february 2024 has been cancelled according to a post from the organizers ira and her team were denied visas after several failed attempts to secure them okay and this is what they said ira star and her team this is what they said. Regrettably, regrettably, sorry, visas were denied despite exploring every avenue possible to secure them for Ira Star and her team. This has happened numerous times with other artists from West Africa, though they are not to blame. We apologize for any inconvenience caused to 
any or to those who have already purchased tickets. All previously purchased tickets will be fully refunded. So I don't basically know why this is happening. I know recently South Africa did a, a visa waiver for Ghana. So for Ghanaians, you need to travel. And then upon arrival, they will stamp in your passport and then issue your visa for you. I don't know if it is the same with Nigeria. Okay, but the article is saying that it has happened to you know, some West African artists, and then I don't actually know why they are doing it to Nigerian artists, because Nigerian artists are bigger and well-known. And someone like Arasta won't even be in South Africa to stay. She wouldn't even think of it, because she's a global icon now, and doesn't need to settle up in South Africa to make ends meet. So the question of the day to my viewers, what do you think has necessitated, all right, for the embassy, of South Africa to deny Arasta her visa and then herself and the team the visa to South Africa. Is it because of security reasons where they feel that during the show, because of the football match between South Africa and Nigeria, it can cause, you know, chaos and anarchy. It can cause, you know, things that are unforeseen circumstances to probably happen. Do you think so? Or do you think it's a deliberate attempt of the embassy to deny Arasta because of what Nigeria or because of the Super Eagles win over Bafana. Bafana, well, I don't actually understand the whole narrative of this denial. I don't understand why they would, they would do that to cost an event with, uh, whose tickets have been bought on already and then fans are looking forward to, you know, meeting the, you know, uh, meeting Ira Star, all right? So it's, it's quite, you know, unfortunate to South Africans, but I don't know. What do you also think? What do you also think? Share your thoughts with me in the comment section, all right? Because I, I actually don't know. And I think Arasta and her team might have been booked. They might have been paid all the, you know, monies due them. Are they going to refund it? Uh, or are they going to have a round table with the organizers and refund the money? Well, that is a topic for another day, but that is on the bill. Arasta and her team have been denied visas to South Africa for a show. And our fans in South Africa are not pleased about it. All right. Okay. So share your thoughts with me in line with the editorial as I bring today's editorial to an end. I'll be monitoring the situation closely and I'll be sharing details of it with you as time goes on or in my, you know, upcoming episodes. All right. Okay. My name has always been TJY. You can call me a mecca. Friday, you can call me TJY. I am your commander in chief. I am the chief campaign. Do well to subscribe, share your thoughts with me in the comment section, and also do well to hit the notification button, which is going to enable you to get notified whenever I post any new video. It is time to go. I salute and peace out.